I like to keep it to myself. <laughs> but um, it was something that was stirring in me, but um, after they came off vacation, after they came off vacation, and since we're talking about vision, it's still based upon vision. Amen? Amen. Um, before I go to my scripture, I'm just going to give you a brief history of me. Amen. Who Randy is? Who Randy? Who Pastor Randy Smith is? Um, well, I never had no um, spiritual um, experience by, um, you know, the Lord came to me and <laughs> At, at the age of eight and stuff and save at that age. That never happened to me. Amen? Amen. Never did. Um, I think one time, young, I think one time somebody ministered to me. I think that was Job a witness. And, 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 your mother, and your mother always tell you, run from those people. Yeah. You know? And, um, but I got saved. And I got born again. I got born again. I got filled. And, um, Leave it to me, just Randy now. If it was just me, I wouldn't even want to do this. Amen? Amen. So I, um, my pulpit is um, on my job, in my neighborhood and so forth. I wouldn't want to do this. Amen? Amen. But it so happened that I'm doing it. Amen? Amen. And um, what I love about Jesus Christ Center Ministry International, it taught me some stuff. Amen. And one of the first things it taught me was love. I find out that I didn't love people. So, I have to get this love inside me. Yes, sir. Another thing it taught me was perspective. The way you see things. Yes. And how you see things. Amen? Um, this church itself taught me that. And um, not knocking other churches, what we get in here is a lot. Amen? Amen. What we get in this ministry is a lot. And I don't want, I be the only one who just greedy for the word and just get all of the stuff and, and y'all don't get it. Amen? Right. But um, this ministry taught me a lot. And my goal here at this um, at this ministry is just to hold the man of God, Anna. Amen. When he get tired, hold his hand. Amen? Amen. And, um, just my concern coming in now. I don't know if this with Bishop. Bishop didn't put me up to do this. But um, like I said, this is a word that came to me. And um, uh, now I, um, I operate with integrity. And I operate with, um, I have to ask, I ask questions as well too. Because I don't want to know I'm doing something. You know, or the hard or just for myself and so forth. Amen? And guess what? Let us pray. We need to pray. Amen? Amen. Let us pray. Father God, I pray right now, Father God, that what is said today, let it just don't be of pastor around you, but it is of you. Father God, there is no superstar, only you. Mm -hmm. Father God, I ask you right now, Father God, to let me present this message with grace. Let your hearers hear it with grace. It will be no condemnation, no downfall, no, no shame, no offense, no strife. But it just be pure grace, Father God. I thank you in advance for what you're doing, for what you're about to do, and what you have already done in our lives. In Jesus' name, amen. 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 No offense. Amen? Amen. No offense. So I have to ask for, you know, just a little permission because you don't know, you know. You, you can think you hear from God and you don't hear from God. Amen? But about the vision, I want to talk about this word right here. I'm trying my best to write it big. Y'all can see that word? Okay. I think the blue one was working. Yeah. Yeah. What's it? <laughs> see that? 
<coughs> now when I say partnership, I am talking about my man of God here. Amen? Amen. Um, I get to watch Bishop display um, from what God taught him, and he just give it out. Um, I think he was in Freeport, and I get to be with this man. And he wouldn't say these things, but um, I saw this. And um, I watched Bishop operate. I watch how he give people that word, just like what the mission statement say now. Yeah. To feed the flock of God. Yeah. To raise up effective leaders. And if any of y'all is a leader, I know I am. <laughs> Amen? Because yeah. I'm getting this word. Yeah. And I'm watching it display. Amen? Amen? Yeah. And I watch him. I watch him and I watch him. And you know, you watch them like a hawk. I know Bishop long time. And still the same person. And Knowing him, right? I said to myself that what the congregation need to do. Amen, Pastor. I know I'm glad to see you. Amen. I'm glad to see you. That's how I know it from God. Listen here. That's how I know it from God. I, I wonder if um, I, I wonder if she's still on vacation or what. I hear she did hurt herself and all. But God is good. Amen. And um, God didn't even want me to present this message. Um, asked her, I mean, and, um, we had a car problem. We thought the car got fixed. We using somebody else's car, and um, we going to when we go on for the car, I drive in the car, and all of a sudden, every time I press gas, it looks like the car won't go in reverse. I just, I say, why the car straining? It's just straining, you know. And the gear don't want to go up no more. It only want to go to twenty. And I say, sure, I'm making more than twenty miles per hour. I say, what the deal is with that? And, um, and then I smell something burning and the mechanic asked me if I was driving with the brakes on, but I said no. But that's just how the problem is. All where the devil just don't want me to, you know? But he's a liar. Amen. Amen. And this message can go on. Amen. And whoever partake in this, I'm going to show you all your blessing. Amen? Amen? Sometimes we don't know things. And you just don't want to do it because of other people doing it. But guess what? It's benefits in this stuff. Amen? Amen. You all have your Bible? Amen. Turn to turn with me down. Where you all think we go in? <laughs> Let's go right in a second to me. <laughs> you pray, Rick. You know that. You all know what the scripture about? Yeah. Let me tell you what 2 Timothy about. Let me tell you what 2 Timothy about. This 3, 16. Let me tell you what 2 Timothy about. Here it is, Paul in prison. And he's talking to Timothy here now. And he said, you know what? Perilous time is coming. Yeah. This, this is what he telling Timothy. Yes, yes. He tell him to watch out for the false prophet. Watch out for the and he said in this time, he said there can be some truth breakers, uh, people who don't who don't um, honor their parents, uh, people who don't um, mind all sorts of stuff, all sorts of stuff. They can be boastful. They can be proud. They can be just a bunch of arrogant people. Now we see this going on, right? We see this going on. So now, what would be the answer to help Timothy? Because this time coming. What would be the answer? So he sent him straight to the word. Amen. He sent him straight to the word because this is what is going to happen. Yeah. And guess what? Some of these people now, they're right here. Amen. They're Jesus Christ and the ministry. Amen. They're right in here. They don't keep their word and all of this stuff. They don't keep their word. They don't operate with integrity. Jesus, so they're right in here and... and, and and he giving them here it is just the antidote that don't be discouraged but be encouraged yes yes he tell Timothy to be encouraged yes he tell him about the calling and he tell him say you know what stick to this word yes, yes sir yes yes sir I know you know what he tell him the second Timothy 3 16 and 17 it's a all scripture you know what? Let me read up top. I love this. <laughs> Let's start from verse 10. But thou hast fully known my doctrine, manner of life, purpose, faith, long-suffering, charity, patience, persecution, affliction which came upon me at Antioch, Iconium, and Lystra. What persecution I endure. 
what persecution I endure. But out of them, all the Lord deliver me. See, he can deliver you now. Yeah. Although all of this stuff is happening, mm -hmm. he can deliver you. Yeah. Man, and, and Paul have a way of just dealing with things. I love Paul. He said here, <laughs> where am I? Verse 12. Yea, yeah. yeah, and all that will live godly in Christ Jesus, sure, suffer. So now here it is, we can suffer some stuff. Yes, yes sir. Yeah. Mama, they good stuff because he's still giving us, he can give us the answer. Yeah. Yeah. Amen? Amen. So, so, so this Christian journey, don't, I don't want to be like those Christians because they don't look good. No, I and I can address that matter too. Some must be look, you know, when they say when they fast, since they don't have that look, you better wash your face. Yeah, don't come with your baby in your eye, make it look like you're, you know, no, we ain't gonna do that. Say, <laughs> so spill, suffer persecution, but evil men. And so, do, oh yeah, he talked about some gentlemen too. This in um in um, in Moses' time, he talked about how these men, yeah, how they came in, how how, how they came in. This from Moses' time, and he's like, we have some gentlemen who come in, and these in the last days is now, yeah, right. And they can right. make their way right in. Yeah. Right. They can try to seduce those on um, the silly women and so forth. Yeah. All of these stuff now. So this is all we have to be careful for now. Oh, Jesus. We can have to be careful of this. Now, watch what he said here. But evil men and seducers shall wax worse and worse, deceiving and being deceived. But continue, this way, this way here, thou in the things which thou hast learned and has been assured of knowing of whom thou hast learned them. In other words, you learned from me when you was with me, you learned how I did things. Being with Bishop, you learned things. Amen? You watch. I, um, I see Bishop tell me one time um, he was having service and he was ending and I remember um, someone that needed prayer and, and, um, and I noticed that when the ladies came and prayed for the person him as a minister, him as the leader he come and he prayed as well to then you know, service over now and he as a minister too, you do that too so he's showing me you know, some things you can learn through observation and some things he can tell you, but you have to learn. Yeah. Amen? Amen? And so here it is, Paul telling him, the, now you, remember, you, you watch my life. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You watch my life. Right. And you see how I do things. You just see how I do things. This Paul he talking about. Yes. This Paul, I'm telling Timothy this, but I'm just saying, in Timothy shows, he saw Paul. Yes. How Paul do things. Yes. Yes. Amen? Yes. Amen? And listen to what I say here. Verse 15. And that form, a, and that is from a child. No, that is not it. I wanted this, the part where it said, from the word of God, we got wisdom. Go ahead, read that same word. The same way he said. And that from a child, thou hast know it, the Holy Scripture, yeah, this is right here. The Holy Scripture, which are uh, able to make the wise, that's it right there, unto salvation to faith, which is in Christ Jesus. This scripture will be able to make you wise. This what we hold in in our hands. This here. This is not the punch. The guardian. I you know so good. The tribune. That one would have more information. And the punch would have all funny information. No, but this right here. Will be able to make you wise. Now watch you. Yes, now back to now my scripture. David, what do I give me? It's a all scripture mm -hmm. is given by inspiration of God, and it is profitable for doctrine, for reproof, for correction, for instruction in righteousness that the mind of God may be perfect, thoroughly furnished unto all good oh, works. What you can be perfect for? Man, all of those stuff, but coming in these yes, perishable yes, times, man, yes. get this word inside you. Oh you should. God, you yes. don't have no need to be deceived. That's no. right. Amen. Amen. Silly women don't have to be silly have women no. if they get in this. Yes. Why yes. you get silly? You get silly by your WhatsApp and your Facebook. That's why yes. you get silly. Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> That's what happened. Feeding on the wrong things. Feeding on the wrong things. That's what it is. Jesus. You'll become wise. Hallelujah. I want to become wise. You do. So what I have to do? Paul, give Timothy. 
The answer. Yes, sir. He gave him that. Oh, yeah. Now, let me give you a script here. Let's go back to our man of God. Let's go to Galatians 6. Good. Come on, come on. Yes, you know what we have to do as um members? Listen what we have to do. We have to listen. Mm -hmm. Amen. We have to listen. We have to hear what the spirit is saying. Yes. Mm -hmm. yes. Now sometimes I will hear these stuff, right? But sometimes I don't want to say because then I say, I might be out of place. Or the people might want to hear. But as a teacher, I learned this though. Where if they don't hear the first time, they can hear it again. Yes, yes. But I can say it again. Yes. And I can say it again. I can say it again. Yes. Until we get it. Amen. 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 Until we get it. Galatians 6. You all there? Yes. Yes. Let me share what Boy 6 say. Yes. Amen. Yes. Boy 6 say, this Galatians 6, let him that is taught in the word communicate unto him that teacheth all good things. Now, that's King James Version, right? Yeah. And I know I only study of this version. I really don't like this version. You, you know that? <laughs> Listen to what the Amplify say. That the same words. Say the one who is taught the word of God is to share all good things with his teacher. That's what it say. Now watch your, but it ain't finished now. No. It tell us what the thing says. Okay. It say to contribute to his spiritual and material support. Okay. Yes, sir. That's what that say. That's what that say. Yes. Yes. Oh my lord. The one who is taught. See, sometimes you don't like to read this because now when you hear it now. You responsible. Yeah, yeah, responsible. <laughs> if they tell me, Bishop say, Randy, um, the thermostat on that, the turn it off is down, mm -hmm. right? Just three, just three levels, down, warm, and on, or something like that. But anyway, mm -hmm. once he tell me that, guess what? I know now. Mm -hmm. I can't go wrong with that. So now, sometimes when you hear the scripture, sometimes you don't want to say these stuff. Now you're responsible. But listen what it said. The one who has, the one who has taught the word of God. Now I know that's me. Who has taught the word of God is to share all good things with his teacher. With his teacher. Contributing to his spiritual and material support. My Lord. Listen here, I know what it means when you car down. Mm. But car down? Mm -hmm. I don't like using people's stuff. <laughs> uh, Terry say uh, be in the car and all of a sudden she didn't hear nothing, no sound. Mm -hmm. Then all of a sudden when we go to pick up our car, we hear all kind of sound when the car say, oh God, she say, oh Jesus. <laughs> Now, where you have to go to this place and now? Uh, you know, you know, I didn't give you my car like this and all that. So I know yeah. what it means. Yes, sir. Y'all want to have my own? <laughs> I won't cross that sound. Now, we mightn't do that sound. Right. But now we have to explain that sound. Yeah. Yep. Make a blame for it. Because you will get blamed for it. Mm -hmm. I know in that place, I know all that place in there. Who can come? Yeah. <laughs> Uh, but be supposed to help in spiritual mm -hmm. and material support. Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. You know, it's so much on a pastor or a bishop. It's so much on them. That's right. When I first started on this Christian walk, I got married. Before I got married now, the bishop at that time, he counseled us. You know, he counseled us. And it was one time, I think we was getting like two weeks in the arm um, before we get married. And boy, listen here, we started complaining to him. We said, boy, things rough now. Everything was sweet at first. Mm. Until now, two weeks ago, down, he said, oh, you're making progress. That's, that's what the man tell us. <laughs> 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 progress. Yeah. And um, 
The bottle stopped. I watched this. Mm. Now he married us, Pastor Eleanor. He married us. He came to the wedding. Well, he, 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 he did the wedding. He came to the reception. And then Sunday, the man preached. I said, my God, he doing all of this. That just, now, I'm not mature yet in the, in the faith yet. But I saw that just naturally speaking, I said, my God, he did all of this for us. And plus, he's still on a Sunday. He had like two messages. I said, my God, that's a lot of work. And so I said to myself, I said, I know Bishop, have, um, I know you all have concern. And I know you all are calling. I know you all are calling, Bishop. And I said to myself, oh, we should say to ourselves, um, we only burn him down with our problems. What about his spiritual and his material needs? Just think about it. His material, his spiritual, and his material. You are praying for him? Yes, or your problem just too big, you know? Right. I'm ready to walk out on Terry now. I ain't got no time to preach the preacher. I just need to wipe that woman out of my house. That, that's how we think? Yeah. <laughs> that's how we think? That is just all about what us? No. Now, listen here. I know we just support the mother God. Amen. But how do we support it? Mm -hmm. Sporadically, like, like scalable at all, when we have something. Listen here. Right. I get scriptures upon scripture, Pastor Elnor. Mm -hmm. Scriptures upon scriptures. Ahead, Pastor, go ahead. You have to know this. Yes. Let me tell you why you have to know this. Because you could be sitting down there and you just say, I don't know this. So you need to, you need to hear this in order so it could just... Start waking in your spirit now that okay, that's why we do what we do, or that's why others do what they do because you just don't know what ain't nothing wrong with ignorance, you know. No, you're not wrong with that, but when you get it now, when you get wisdom, I'm saying now, then you use it. Yeah, you act on it, you just act on it. Let's go to Troy Samuel. Let me show you where partnership come in. And then we can go to March it. I remember in your Bible, all the S together. Mm. <laughs> Wait, Psalm 30. All the S together. Put all together. Put all the T's together, all the M's together. Amen? Wait, Psalm chapter 30. Now, if you all can't find us, I know you all know the story. David just being the war. When he reached home, he find his village burned. Find his village burned and they captured, they carried the wives and the kids and so forth. They carried them. And the Bible say they weep. They weep till they couldn't weep no more. Now that's something like I love how the Bible put it say the brothers them weep. Tell he couldn't weep no more. And then you know what? After the week, you know, we always find something to do. They was plotting now. Again. You send us out the Bible. Now here it is. My kids, them gone. My wife gone. And so forth. But David, two wives is gone too. So I was trying to figure out if they did kill him now, what was going to happen? Ooh, so what was going to happen? Your kids, them still gone. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> your, your wife, them still gone. Yes, sir. But here it is. Here it is now. He seek the Lord. Oh, that's a good thing to do. Amen. Yes, seek the Lord. And listen, when he seek the Lord, he give him a word and all. Terry, what he said? Pursue. Pursue. Overtake. Overtake. Recover and recover all. Yes. Yeah. He got the word. He got the word. Now something happened while they was journeying now. That something happened now. He carried 600 men. And yep. 200 out of, six, out of the 600, he was tired. Well, the brothers said, yes, we. And they, they did more, yes, we. They just grabbed a bottle, they beat, yeah. but then they, 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 they was conjuring up some stuff to, yes. to, to help kill this man any which way our leader. All of this happening now. All of this happening. So now 200 of them, but now 400 of them, they warned their wives and they warned their kids. 
So, David said, you know what? Let me tell you what to do. Let me tell you what to do. You all stay right here then. You all chill. Just watch the supplies. You never know that. When we fight, we may have to come back and you all just hand out our supplies we go back. But you all stay right here. That's what he tell them. You all in 30, right? Let's look at voice 24. Voice 24. I just give you all what happened just now. All of what happened in in um in um in, in um thirty. Now what I did was I like Bishop, you know. They learned it from my pastor. You know? I had a power phrase um, to get to the main point. Mm -hmm. Amen? Amen? And you could do that too, you know why? That annoys not each and every one of you. You all just have to make up in your own mind. You have to decide that I'm going to do that. Amen. And just take study too. I study. Amen. Don't yeah. worry about my car. I do all of that. But you do these stuff. If you do these stuff. Yes, sir. You got to be diligent in this word. Yes, Amen. This is the only thing I tell you. Perilous time coming. Oh. And I don't have to be a prophet to tell you all that. Timothy just tell you all that. Yes. Yeah. And what to do? You better stick to this word. Amen. Verse 24. <laughs> it says, yeah, For who has? Who will hack it unto you in this matter? But as his part is that go it down to the Bible, we're talking about the 400, so should the part be for that tarry, that's to say, by the stuff. They should part alike. Huh? For 22. <laughs> then answer all the wicked men, all the wicked men and men of, that need that word. Yeah, that word. For those that went, with David and said, because they went not with us, we will not give them all of the spoil. Here it is, that's what they say saying now. Yeah, because if we get in the battle now, no, no, you ain't, you ain't getting none of this. Yeah. And guess what? We like that now. We like that now. I tell y'all, Wednesday, um, um, a friend of ours in Terry, her mom passed away. She got one big check. Big check. Insurance check. Yeah, it was big. She tell me how much it was and all. Big check. Big check. And she asked me, because you know he's a man of God. She asked me, so Randy, I supposed to tie the whole, I should tie 10% of that. I said, yeah. Uh. She said, under her breath, but she was saying, it's talking loud. Mother sick. <laughs> <laughs> That's what she said. Wow. In other words, if we come and we get all of these stuff from this bottle, mm. why should I share? Nice. They ain't do nothing. Wow. They ain't do nothing. So, do nothing. so when we have funds, that's what we do do. Yeah. I can't tie if I get um two hundred thousand dollars. Uh, what is ten percent of that? Twenty thousand. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> you know. How you get in the bike? You place? know what I could do with that? <laughs> I guess notice what roof need I'm repairing. <laughs> yeah. Mm -hmm. That's too much money. But who gave you that? That's a good question. Who gave you, you that? Get money out? <laughs> My God, I'm grateful. Mm -hmm. and so, so the man that was evil and all. And what did they say? Because they went not with us. We will not give them all of the spoil that we have recovered, save <laughs> to every man his wife. So now we're not going to give you your wife now and your kids. We all ain't getting the rest of these stuff. That's, na that's our nature too. Yeah. It might be with Bible, but that's our nature. Yeah, man, that chair come up. No, no, no. We pray that the whole prayer team come up and pray for you, you know? You're in this situation. All of a sudden, God bless you. Hmm. 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 You don't see no one no more. Yeah. Money is something we should not be skinchy about as believers. Right. You know why? When you give, you can get back. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Oh, y'all don't believe that? Oh, yes, I, I do. That. 
I feel, I feel like the only way you believe is that in the pantry. <laughs> or that in the tribune. Oh, no, the word of God said this, 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 this wisdom here. Yeah. So what David say? Let's see what David say. And, and this here, when you're studying, so read this on a different translation. Read this on a different translation. It say, uh, Then said David, you should not do so, my brethren. And he's telling them now. This is the same animal they wanted to kill who was bitter. They done recover now. And here it is, the king who, who, um, who they wanted to kill. Listen to them. He said, you should not do so, my brethren, which thou hast, which the Lord hath given us. Watch it now. Whom hath persuaded us. Preserve. Sorry. Preserve. Preserve. Yeah, that's it. Uh-huh. And deliver the company that came against us into our hands. Right. Now watch what he say now. This way he's bringing in this now. This way this coming in right here. Uh-huh. For who will hack it? This now. Let me read this on a different translation. This translation named the expand translation. Oh man. Yeah, listen here. This this um the message and the amplified in one. Yeah. That's what this is. What is it? Who will listen to what you say mm. when you speak? This why the share will be a eh? the share will be the same for the one who stayed with the supply. You see that? Yeah. He said, um, oh, wait, wait, they're so small. The equipment and the baggage, they stayed with the equipment and the baggage. As for the one who went to battle, all will share alike. So in other words, now, when we partner with this thing, whatever Bishop do, when Bishop go to Freeport or when he go to Andres, we want help so into that. You know why? Amen. They say it's a reward. Oh, we'll yes. be getting Yes. Amen. Amen. Let's go to um, let's go to Matthew ten. It's a reward. Oh yes. It's a reward. Well, I when he, when, 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 um, those um leaders them who we who we um, who, who we minister to. Once we help souls oh, yes. into Him, we getting the same results. It's like we went with Him. Mm -hmm. Yes, sir. Oh, it would be skinny when it come down to money. My Lord. Be skinny when it come down to money. Indeed. That's why it don't get done back. We have to, we supposed to know, you know what? We supposed to put on that mindset like what our bishop have. Put on that mindset. Yes, sir. That, listen, it's a reward in this. Yes. Oh, you know, yes. in Matthew 10, I'll uh, go up again. Before I reach the scripture where I wanted to go. Jesus here, he said in his disciples up, sending them out. And he teach them and, and, and he preached a message to them. So you know the people welcome you then, you know. If not, then don't worry about that. Don't hold no animosity against them. You know, you just go on your way. He even tell them and all that they'll be raising up the dead. They lay hands on the sick and they shall recover and all of those stuff. And you start with 40. He said, He that received it, he that received you. Receive it me. Jesus telling his disciples this now. Mm -hmm. And we can say yes. And he that receiveth me, receiveth him that sent me. Which, um, 41. He that receiveth a prophet in the name of a prophet shall receive a what? And he that receiveth a righteous man, that'll be me, in the name of a righteous man, shall receive it what? A righteous man. That's Matthew 10. That's Matthew 10, 41. Amen? Matthew. Now 42 say, And whosoever should give to drink unto the one of these, or just a cup of cold water, hmm. it, it, water only in the name of the disciple, verily I say unto you, he should no wise lose his reward. It's benefits in this process from. Yes, benefits. Yes, yes, benefits yes, in yes. this. Yes. <laughs> and I believe God designed this system. Hallelujah. I believe He designed this system so that young need could be met. Yeah. And 
Yes. My need to be met. Yes. Everybody else need to be met. Now this yes. has to be something that you know what? I'm gonna be determined now. Yes. Like I say, I know that my car down, but I'm not going to stop. I'm showing the devil, you know what? This ain't the end. Right. I read the end of the book and I found that I still win. Cool. Yes, sir. So I'm not going to let this stop me. I don't have to get right. bent out of shape. I don't have to don't fall apart like a $2 suitcase. Yes, sir. I'm not going to do it. And I'm going to be consistent. Amen. That's the word. Amen. We have to be consistent in this. Yes. This ain't just a say good words to you all and then and let's stop. No, we are not going to do that. If they say a reward is in this, I want a reward. That's me. That's my nature. Build and receive things. When we go to work, we receive a check, right? We receive a check, right? I don't know none of you always say, no, no, that's all right. You keep that. Even by law, they know it's right still to give you a check. Better if you don't do nothing with it. It's by law. Because we are protected as employees. Amen. We are protected. So, so by law, so here it is now. When we do this, we're not doing this in vain. Pastor Gulf, we're not doing this in vain. No, no. And let me speak to my 25% brothers and sisters. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let me speak to the 25. Amen. That's it. I shouldn't even say it like that because I can call up some people. Say what you mean. I can call up some people. So, and then that people might think they're the 25%. But, anyways. <laughs> but I want you to hear this. It's benefits and it is reward. Oh, yes. When you give the man of God, not just a cold drink, but we know what I mean. Yes. Yeah. We have to take care. You know what? I believe that. Um, he won't pray. He won't pray for Jesus Christ Center of Ministry International and all his partners and so forth. He won't pray for them. But now he concerned. Junior got to go to school. Jazzy got to go to school. How we can do this? How I can do that? Macabre break down. But here it is now. We. We who could help. We who could help. I hope you don't ask me. <laughs> <laughs> you think we think like that? Yes, I'm hope not. That. Yeah, hope not. Yeah, hope, hope not. not. That'll be on there. And why should I give him my money for just for my little girl just to eat ice cream? <laughs> yeah. Blizzard, Dairy Queen. Uh -huh. I hope we don't think like that. Oh, we won't give them a whole glass of yes, water. Sir. Yes, sir. That's what we want to do. That's what we want to do. Support, support. Being, mm. Now, being in this ministry, though, sometimes, I'm going to get myself in problem. I love to speak to leaders. Yes. Why I speak to leaders is because once the, the front line be the front line. You put all the generals in the front. <laughs> you put all the generals in the front. Yeah. You, you, you want them. Yeah. And these say I just will fall in line afterwards. Mm -hmm. But it's really for the leaders. Yes. I got you. We have a part to play. Yes, yes. Well, we I'm have a part to play. I got you. Now, we know Luke 6, 38. Yeah. We know what it said. Tell us to give. And it says some stuff is going to happen when you give. Yes, yes. Surely the do. first time, the first time I tell you, just, just, just new into this, just being born again. And I saw that scripture in there. I was at Calvary Deliverance. And somebody said, um, somebody said that scripture. He said, man, I can't be in there. I heard it at first. I said, you trying to tell me God know about soul. I told only we know about soul in this age. Press down and shake it together. And run out. I said, that can't be in the Bible. Man. I go on no more soda. Because I know once I shake soda, I know what happened. Oh, no, yeah. I said, that can't be in the Bible. <laughs> only me, no, God don't know that. God only know about holy stuff. You ain't know about that. But that in the Bible. Is it when you give? Now, but some of us say, 
But I give in. But ain't nothing happening. Sure. Could you think it could be a mo? Could it be? Uh, the Bible says you can have what you say, right? Yeah, yeah. Oh my God. Give for me I, I, um, I think I had to tell my kids that one time, you know, they, they just talk like how young people talk. Actually, you crazy or you fool? I said, she kind of stopped that. But daddy, I mean it. But then why are you saying that? Why are you saying that? you saying it what to sound cool. I know you cool, beautiful girl. I know you cool, but you don't have to say that. We, as believers, have a language. So why are we saying these negative oh, stuff? Yeah. Why are we saying, how are angels so confused? My God. Preach better. Are they stupid? Preach better. So the Preach stupid fella better don't ask me nothing like that, especially if he believe it. Uh, yeah. yeah. So the Bible say we can have what we say. Oh, yeah. Yeah. We'll say that over and over and over. Guess what? We are still walking that door. But you stupid. <laughs> Be careful. Uh-huh. Yes, uh-huh. We walk right out that door. Yes, sir. And guess what we do it all the time? Yes, Thinking it sound cool. Yes. I would never call my car stupid. I need my car. Yes. I would never call my car stupid. Or oh, this piece of junk. No. <laughs> this doesn't get me from point A to point B. That's right. Oh, this stupid life. Uh-huh. Yeah. yeah. And people will know this message, you know. Preach. But why should I take on what the young people say? Oh so why can't I see what the Bible say? Yes, sir. Some young people find it bad. Why would you talk to your wallet? I talk to me. I speak to my wallet. Yeah. I blame you. Just like how you speak and say your, to your friend, your stupid self. Jesus speak to a tree. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, he speak yeah. to a man. Thank you. Yes, ah, Thank go you ahead. That's what he did. He hey, speak preach. to the dead. Preach, Thank you. preach brother. Preach. That's what he did. Preach. Preach. Oh, yes. Preach. Why are we afraid of giving on money supposed to be the least? Uh, Why are we afraid? Preach. You are think you are carrying this bitch on? No. Ah, uh, preach. <laughs> you think you are carrying this bitch on? No. Naked. Oh, Man, it got to be a way to bring some of this money with me. Oh my God. It gotta be a way. Nope. Yeah. It gotta be a way. <laughs> but here it is, the mind of God. That really the time? Yes. Oh God. Go ahead, go ahead. Let the Lord use it. Finish our message. You gotta finish that one. <laughs> you, got, you got on after mm -hmm. you got on after eleven. Okay. On like about okay. Okay. Amen. And you're supposed to say. I don't want to stop my blessing in my free time. Well, let's throw the clock out the window. Amen? Bring that clock here. Bring that clock here. In 2 Kings, mm -hmm. it was a prophet. And this lady watched the prophet come every day and she'd give him a meal. Right. And tell you know what she did? She um, built a house, built a house. Built a just for the prophet every time he come in town. Every time he come in town. You know? Listen what the prophet said. He asked his Right on, man. If I could say that. He asked his right on, man. He said, Man, ask a lady. What she want? What she want? Yeah. What she want? Yeah. What she want? yeah. The, the, the brother said, um, I don't think she have a chat. I don't think she have a chat. The brother proclaimed a blessing. This is what prophet does. Yes. That's what they do. She partnered with the prophet. Yes, she did. Yes, she did. She give. Right. He ah. give back to her. Man, you all have to read this Bible, you know. This all through the Bible. I can't even go to all of these scripture. Um, Luke, Luke 6. They talk about how Susanna and um, another lady, yeah. several how they support, and several ladies got Mary Magdalene. Oh, they talk Jesus. about Mary Magdalene. Yeah. They supported Jesus. Mm. Yes, yes. That's what they did. Yeah. Mm. So you all just think his ministry is like, I know you are thinking this. I am selfish. Um, the money just can fall from the sky. Mm. Now Jesus could have done that, you know. But no, he was operating, although he is God, he was operating as a man. So that ministry, that needed earthly things. Yeah. Yeah. That needed yeah. earthly things. Yeah. My Lord. Yeah. Come on. It ain't gonna be no heavenly money to keep this light on. No. Or keep the 
the AC from running or for it to be clean. No, it don't take that. It don't take that. It take money. And I don't know if you don't like to say that too, but I can say it. Money. That's right. Take money to run. It take money to run this ministry. It take money to help him. Yes. Amen. It can take money to do that. Amen. And I believe just like that lady. Who was helping a prophet? My God. You can get benefits. These yeah. are rewards oh, with coming. These are earthly yes. rewards with yeah. confidence. Yeah. Yeah. You need have to get men. Yeah. And sometimes when you excuse me, when you're feeling down, when you're feeling down. Because I've been there. But I left. Amen. I ain't be sad. And I'm gonna give. Amen. And I'm gonna inspire. And I'm not gonna tell you all what to give and so forth. Listen here now. When we give, this can be a continuous thing. Listen here. I made up in my mind. You see me. Um, I, I can share this. I gotta give Bishop a thousand dollars. That's what I'm saying. I can give him a thousand dollars and and um what I'm gonna do is um I do fifty dollars every week and tell the thousand. You don't tell the thousand come up, right? Mm -hmm. And then what you do next? Make another plan. <laughs> I would make it like, and that's how some of us give. We give like, okay, I don't know how to make mine a thousand dollars. He get a thousand. I said, no, no, we can do that. We're not going to do that. Amen. Now I let my car on the bike. What I'm saying, I'm going to continue. You know why? Because boy, listen here. That's the only way, boy. I can say this. Mr. Thompson didn't get everything what he get just by himself. No, no. Working in the department where I work in now, we have several departments. And all of this, I, I stay watching it. This make everything flow. That's how this company is an over $30 million company. They got me in inventory. So anything that I don't do it, I don't deal with the part what goes out. I deal with the stuff that comes in. Inventory. Right, this inventory now. Then you got some who deal with um, what you call it? Uh, like overseas inventory. They fall when on the dock, when they bring it in containers. I don't deal with that, but you have people who deal with that. Yep. Then you have people who take the stuff off. You got people who put them in the slot. Then you have fellas there who sell the product. You have fellas who pick the product. You have fellas who put the products in yeah. That's what make this company successful. Yes, sir. Teamwork. 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 Yes, sir. We want Jesus Christ said administering in the national. We want to flourish. Yes. Yes. But how this can work? It can work by each and every one of you. Taking part. Amen. Yes, sir. That's it. Amen. I don't like a person who complains. Now I don't like that. Well, Bishop, Brandy should have said like that. <coughs> or like that. <laughs> then you come to me. You come to me. Now, last year was wrong. But you don't have to get a, uh, an alliance or a clip or someone, you know. As a lovely person, you know. Trust me, I'm a lovely person. You don't have to talk with me. Yeah, you don't have to. But for this to work, all of us have to play a part. But I, I, like they say, I, I suppose and I love leaders. I'm going to start with the leaders. I mean, you can't stand up with them. They call your name. All right. Stand up, Pastor Elmer. Okay, amen. Stand up, Pastor Godfrey. Strongs. Pastor. Pastor Ostel. I love that man. Pastor Bob. 